All right, we're just responding to a call from the fire department. Apparently, somebody's trying to disturb them and trying to pick up a fight with them. Not exactly sure what's going on, but hopefully everything is all right. Yeah, there's a bunch of people huddled up in front of the garage right there. Okay, yeah, looks like we got a paramedic over here. We did nothing wrong. Come and help quick before he hurts one of my mates. Oh, my goodness. What is even going on? Oh, my God. Okay, well, yeah, let's go over here. Oh, my goodness. So, no more sirens. What is going on? Okay, sir, can we please calm down? Sir, please calm down, okay? Can you explain exactly what's going on over here okay we got called over here because apparently you're being extremely aggressive towards these firefighters over here who are just trying to do their job okay they woke me up they are loud what do you mean they're loud i don't really understand there are sirens sir i wouldn't really call them obnoxious because they risk their lives every single day to save civilians like you this their sirens they wake me up i mean sir that's kind of just i mean that's life like without sirens a lot of bad things would happen right sirens are pretty necessary so i'm mean, whether you like it or not um they're they have sirens okay and i'm sorry if it woke you up or anything but it's kind of just how life goes all right i need sleep I mean, honestly, it's kind of your fault. Hey, okay, no, 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 put the crowbar down. No, sir, no, okay, hey, hey, hey. All right, uh, yeah, you guys can back up, you guys back up. Hey, sh put the, hey, no, put the crow, oh my goodness. Yo, okay, okay, hey, hey, okay, okay, hey, no, 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 okay, uh, yeah, just pin him on the ground right there. Oh, whoa, 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 no, 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 wait, get, Ryan, why did you let him go, why did you let him go? Oh, God, okay, in the vehicle, quick, 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 let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh, Ryan, 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 where are you? Oh my goodness, Ryan, why are you walking in the middle of the road? Okay, uh, where did he go? Oh my goodness, okay, he's right, he's right there. Oh god, okay, looks like he's gonna be turning on the highway right over here. Oh my goodness, that happened so quickly. I thought you tased him. How did he get up so quickly? Oh god, okay. Uh, looks like he's gonna be going towards the bridge here. Jeez, he is taking so much speed. What the heck? Oh my god, what just happened in the last 30 seconds? Oh god, okay. Oh, is he doing a U-turn on the highway? Oh my, I think he even crashed. Oh my goodness, okay, well, good thing the highway isn't too busy here, because if it was, then you would have already smashed into, like, 15 vehicles. Um, anyways, okay, looks like he's gonna be going down the other side of the highway here. Ryan, if you can get some more units on the pursuit with us. Yo, he is going so fast, I can barely even see him anymore. Oh my, okay, uh, it looks like he's gonna be turning off the highway. I can't even see that far, jeez, where is he? Oh my goodness, okay, Ryan, are we gonna have any more units here on the pursuit with us? Because this car is, like, 10 times faster than ours, even though we have an electric vehicle, which I'm actually pretty happy about um actually it's the only electric vehicle in the department um but i think they're getting more actually in a couple weeks um anyways it looks like we're gonna be passing over the bridge here for like the second or third time oh my goodness he just drift oh my goodness okay that was a crazy drift right there okay looks like we're gonna be passing back on the bridge here uh this is the fourth time we're gonna be going down the highway over here is he just gonna keep doing this until he loses us or something i have no idea what this guy's thinking um anyways okay looks like he's slowing down a bit i'm not too sure what he's thinking um but yeah looks like we're gonna be getting more units soon uh which hopefully is the case uh whoa whoa okay oh my goodness oh god uh, what just happened ryan did you see that Oh my, okay, wait, let me back up, what, oh my goodness, yo, he just, like, flew off the highway, uh, okay, Ryan, get FD over here, get heavy rescue, and get more LCSO units down here as quick as possible, uh, yeah, if you can just go and check up on the car, okay, I'm gonna bring the car down the highway, okay, I'm gonna do a little U-turn here on the highway, and I'm gonna be taking the exit right over here, anyways, I'm gonna be heading down to the road where that vehicle who flew off the highway is, I have no idea what he was thinking, I mean, he just, like, it almost looked like he did it on purpose. He, like, turned on the side of the highway and just completely went off the highway. Maybe he slipped or something, but I would be very, very surprised if that was the case. Anyways, here he is. Oh, my goodness. Oh, God, look at him. Okay, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna park over here. We're probably gonna get heavy rescue and FD over here, so I'm just gonna, you know, make sure um, there's room for them to uh, park up right over here on the grass. Um, I'm actually gonna move my vehicle here to the intersection to block it off. Um, or, yeah, actually partially block it off here since I do need to let FD uh, pass through. Uh, yeah, Ryan, I placed my vehicle right there. Uh, we should have FD here in a couple minutes. So, yeah, if you can just manage traffic, if we have any oncoming civilian vehicles, just tell them that we've got a situation here and they can take another route to get to where they need to go. All right, okay. Uh, okay, so, yeah, I can't really do anything right now. Okay, yeah, it looks like uh, Station 2 over there is responding. Actually, that's pretty ironic because this guy was trying to fight the fire department and guess who needs the help of the fire department now 
the guy who was who doesn't like the fire department. So basically, the guy who was mad against the fire department is now the person who needs to be rescued by them, which is extremely ironic, and it's honestly pretty ridiculous. So okay, we got FD on scene over here. They're gonna be approaching the vehicle, and they're probably gonna get all their equipment out uh, to get this guy outside of his vehicle. But yeah, he like smashed into like this cliff over here um and he also smashed into this pole but good thing the pole didn't fall down um but yeah like his driver's door is absolutely smashed up so they're probably gonna have to use like a spreader and cutters uh to get um his door open and stuff so uh yeah we also got an ems guy here who's probably gonna be on standby um while uh, the heavy rescue guys will be uh, opening the the car door up and getting um the suspect out of the vehicle um anyways ryan yeah we got fd on uh the vehicle there so yeah i don't think they really need our help um but yeah if you can just start blocking this road off over here i don't think we'll have any other fd will be coming uh we're definitely getting other lcso units to come on the scene soon um but yeah i'm surprised it's taking this long for uh the, sh the other deputies to come over here because i mean i don't know if you remember but you basically called them when we were beginning the pursuit and i mean the pursuit has already ended and we still don't have a single lcso unit here so not too sure what's going on with them maybe they're super busy or something but um as far as i can tell in the as far as i can tell in the radio doesn't look like we have many calls right now so um uh, that was half an hour i know right okay crazy and oh yeah okay looks like on another lcso vehicle over there he's uh near the high rock park entrance i think they'll be blocking off the road over there so all right, so we got another deputy over here. I think he's going to be blocking this road off. I'm just going to bring my vehicle to the other side over there, uh, to the other unit. I'm just going to see if he's all right and everything. Or I'm just going to give him some more information on what's going on because he's probably absolutely clueless right now as to what's actually going on over here. Um, anyways, yeah, if you can just get the, the, the this road blocked off here with cones, manage traffic. Uh, and yeah, where's Ryan here? What is Ryan doing here? Okay, uh, Ryan, stop getting distracted. I always talk about that. Okay, uh, yeah, okay, come in my vehicle, Ryan. I'm just going to drive you down down to uh um the vehicle um uh the vehicle crashed um remember that the vehicle crashed is still a suspect who was harassing fire department uh personnel so we still have to keep an eye on him even though he's probably already dead or something um so yeah ryan if you can just keep an eye on him okay if fd need help then help them but yeah just keep an eye on him uh just making sure if he you know making sure he's not like if he's not aggressive or anything all right anyways everything is looking good over here i'm just gonna explain to these deputies over here what exactly is going on uh hey cd how you doing uh yeah we basically we were in uh we were in a pursuit um of that guy i don't know if you remember about the call we had at the fire department uh about the guy harassing the fire department personnel well yeah basically we were pursuing him and the idiot basically drove off the highway i'm not exactly sure what he was thinking um but yeah he basically crashed in the cliff and now he's like dying or whatever i don't even know what his condition is i'm gonna go and check up on him in just a couple minutes um so yeah if you can just keep the road blocked off fd is doing a pretty efficient job over there so they should be done maybe in 15 20 minutes you know um and uh yeah i guess we'll have dot here in a couple minutes as well uh yeah not much traffic at all so um yeah if ever they do come here just make them do like a u-turn in the district office parking lot and they can just uh you know uh, go back the other way. All right. Uh, yeah. So yeah, I'll, I'll I'll stay in touch. I'll stay in, I'll stay in contact with you um, via the radio. So uh, don't worry. Um, anyways, I just realized my uh, electric vehicle here was at seven percent. I do have to say this vehicle's battery runs out extremely quickly. Like yeah, look, it just turned to six, and I'm sure um, by the time I get over there, it's already gonna be five or something. But yeah, I d I mean electric vehicles are great. The only downside I feel is that um the battery runs out quickly. It might be actually just like a not very good battery. It might be just that like. Um, I have like a deficient car or something because I it's I definitely find it a bit surprising that my battery runs out so quickly I'm probably gonna have to talk to the department about that because I don't think it's normal at all Anyways, Ryan looks like uh, FD got him out of the car here and they're gonna be bringing him inside the ambulance Um, but yeah, they've got like, hydraulic struts and everything placed on the vehicle there, which is pretty cool actually Um, you know looking at FD doing their job like this. I mean, it's pretty rare that we see heavy rescue in action um, especially like getting um 
a guy out of a vehicle like that. Actually, never mind. It happens pretty often, but um, never like a you know like a criminal or a suspect that we're chasing. That never happens. He was literally harassing you guys at the beginning, and now it's kind of like instant karma because like 15 minutes later he's like laying in an he's gonna be laying in like a hospital about to die. So if I'm gonna be honest, if somebody was being aggressive towards me and he was yelling at me. And 15 minutes later, I had to help that person out um, to save his life. I would honestly be a bit mad and I would be a bit frustrated. But yeah, you guys are doing a great job. So, all right. So the paramedic got him in the ambulance and I guess he's going to be leaving right now. Um, they're probably going to be bringing him to the River City Hospital, which is the biggest hospital um, over here in the county. And uh, yeah, probably the best hospital uh, for what uh, treatments that guy needs. Because I think, yeah, they're going to have to bring him to like... Uh, the ICU or something. My vehicle's at like 5% battery right now, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to Springfield, I'm gonna recharge it, um, and Ryan, if you can stay here with the other officers just to write down the report, um, and I'm gonna come back in about 30 minutes or something, um, you know, however much time it takes to charge the thing, and I'll come and pick you up uh, for the rest of our shift, alright? Um, so yeah, you guys have a great rest of this thing over here, I'll be back in about 30 minutes, alright? Anyways guys, if you did enjoy this video, please like and subscribe, and if you do wanna be in real plays like these, then do make sure to join the discord linked in the description down below anyways guys thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one